right. Welcome back to the channel. I'm Ethan, 602 Crate Late Model. Fast one. Anyways, so we're doing something a little bit different today. Something that we've never done because we've never received here on this channel. Sorry, I'm sweaty and messy and disgusting because I've been out cleaning this guy because we've been down. Transmission took a poop during that last race that we had. So we've been we've been trying to get that fixed and yada yada and blah 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 and blah blah blah. You may remember uh, a couple of weeks ago I did a breakdown video. Gosh, it's probably been a couple months ago now, but I did a breakdown video of a fight uh, down at a racetrack in Florida. I can't even remember the name of the racetrack. Southern Raceway, maybe. I cannot remember. But if you remember the video, then you will remember Orange Shirt Man, who was an American hero who pulled out a sneaky from the foot department and tripped. Ashton Winger up, and it was one of the greatest moves we've ever seen um, in uh, foot tripping history, I would say. Probably at the Mount, it's probably on the Mount Rushmore of foot trips, I would say. I don't know, I don't watch a lot of fighting, uh, but I think I could be a good judge of foot trips. It was a fantastic foot trip, uh, ultimately. Many of you made sure I knew that that was GR Smith's t-shirt guy. Like, hey, that's his merchandise guy. Many of you told me in the comments. And T-shirt guy, orange shirt guy, as we referred to him in the video, whose real name is Scotty. Uh, hope he doesn't mind me saying that. I, I'd hate that. He, I hate that. I would hate to think that he would. But anyway, Scotty reached out to us on our Facebook page and was like, "Hey, dude, enjoyed the video," which is always nice because you never know. Like when you make those videos, who's going to have a sense of humor and who's not? I, in fact, one of my buddies was like, "Hey, if Gr Smith ever catches you outside." probably gonna be a problem and I was like I don't know why because I didn't even say nothing bad about anybody I just complimented uh, orange shirt man's takedown techniques and I didn't fully understand some of the GR actions on the track and I certainly didn't understand the winger interactions in the pits so but you never know right like you never know what who people are and what they think and blah 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 but T Scotty reached out and he sent some merch so first off this is the, he gave me two shirts. Well, let me flip the camera around. There you go. So this is the front uh, of the both shirts, both shirts, uh, work in dirt and then play in dirt with the dirt light model right there on the back of that one. So I, I've got an orange shirt now, which I'm assuming gives me superpowers. Uh, I'm a hundred percent. This is like my F around and find out shirt. If you see me with this shirt at the racetrack, it's going to be a problem. This is, you can approach me. I'm good to go. We can talk, we can be friends. F around and find out, we can have it, we can be friends. But the orange shirt, when you put that orange shirt on, it means you're about that business. It means you're about that business. It means you're not gonna come and attack some of my friends. That's what that means. That's what I assume it means. Now, the other thing he sent me was some stickers. I hope that shows up the right way in the camera because like the way I'm looking at it, it's not, it's not right. But if you want to pick up some of his shirts or I'm not sure what else he has. I know he has stickers, obviously, shirts and stickers for sure. Dirt King Apparel. He's on Facebook. Look him up. Thanks, Scotty. I appreciate it a ton. I'm actually going to try to put this sticker somewhere inside here so that the, like the, so the GoPro will catch it as we race so that everyone, so it'll be visible all the time so that maybe, you know, you can get a little bit more business headed your way. I've looked at some of the videos and I'm not exactly sure where, I'm not exactly sure where I can put it to where it's going to be perfectly seen every time, but uh, because I do the, I do the, I do the in-car stuff on the, I do the in-car and then I have the other camera in the way because this region would be perfect, but it's always blocked by the on-track video. So I got to figure out, I think right, I think right there is going to be where I put it. Uh, yeah, that'll probably be it. So that's, that way it's always seen. Uh, and Dirt King Apparel has, you know, it's not a sponsorship or anything like that. Just reached out, sent me some shirts, and boom, I'm gonna, I'll, I'll do my best to get you some business headed your way. I appreciate you a ton. I enjoyed making that video, and thanks for being a good sport. Now, as for this wagon right here, this wagon right here, where are we going? What are we gonna do? <laughs> it's a great question, really. It's a great question. It's not a bad question. Uh, I think on the list of questions that you might have, that's probably a good one. I don't know yet. We may go to Clarksville Thursday and race uh, for a thousand to win down there. I don't know why it's a Thursday show, but it is. And then we may end up down there Saturday, it, but I doubt we do both. I doubt we do both. So if we go Thursday, we won't go Saturday. If we go Saturday, obviously we didn't go Thursday. Unless things are like really good and then sure, why not? Let's go to both. But I mean, historically speaking, I don't know if that's an option. So that's it. That's where we may be going. I really, really, really wanted to go to Thunder Hill this weekend down in, uh, in Tennessee. 
but they got them they got them d21 rules man and we just don't have a whole lot of d21s i thought about tearing through this pile and just seeing what we had but man if anybody if anybody's got some left side d21s they just want to donate they don't even donate because i've got entirely too many tires i just don't have any 21s that would work for down there i got some yeah all right, so there's a two percent chance we might go to Summertown. Not Summertown. Is it Summertown? Thunder Hill. You get what I'm saying. But anyways, all that information will be on our Facebook. Be sure to go check out DerekKingApparel.com. Is this the shortest video we've ever done? Very well could be. Very well could be. I gotta do some work here, uh, and then this car is gonna be pretty much good to go. Also, thanks to John DeVazier for fixing our transmission because it's just constantly something around here, and the transmission was the victor. The was the villain of the protagonist in the story this time. That's all I got. I love each and every single one of you. Thanks for watching this video. I'm sorry it was short, but I wanted to be, I wanted to make a video, especially, I don't know how to, golly, how do I, oh, there it is for, for the guy that sent us stuff. Uh, people are always more than welcome to send us stuff. We'll, we'll blow you up on our channel or try to. Chances are not a lot of people will watch this video, but maybe they will. As always, I love each and every single one of you, but now I gotta go. Bye.